so welcome back so in this video i will be teaching you how to create a yes or no message box so in our previous video we only made a okay message box so in this video we'll be doing yes or no so just like before as usual we include our library and then we also have our title of the message box and the caption of the message box so in this case it is still hello there and please subscribe to my channel and now i put two more strings so that is yes message and no message which puts thank you for subscribing and why did you click no okay so the only difference from our previous message box is this okay so instead of mb okay you put mb yes no so which stands for message box yes no and again we just push the title of our message box and the caption of our message box and then zero okay and lastly we call message box a okay so at this point everything is the same so how to check for the condition of the message box so the condition so if you click yes eax will become six and if you click no the eax will become seven so we can just do a compare eax six which is the default value for yes and if that is equal then the user clicked yes okay so if they clicked yes we will just push the offset of the yes message and call std out okay which will push thank you for subscribing and if the user click no which is seven then it will just push the offset of no message and show why did you click no okay so let's try our program console build all no problems let's run sample.exe and as you can see the title of message box is hello there and the caption is please subscribe to my channel if i click yes then it will show thank you for subscribing but if i rerun the program again and i click no it will show why did you click no okay so again this is how you do it and i hope to see you again next time